The ones that'll be out in two more weeks. And their boyfriends don't know they're doing it. Oh. That's my favorite. Nice shot. Wow. <laughs> what is that? One, two? You son of a bitch? That's great. great. great I'm going to open up, you son of a bitch. I'm on one, four. Oh, God damn you. It's an 85 prime. That's why. Yeah. I don't even have an 85 on here. Great lighting. Like light? Great lighting. I like that. I appreciate Good it. Time. Why is everyone leaving me hanging today? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't see that. I'm not looking at that. Don't tell. Don't tell. Are you rolling? Oh, yeah. keep, keep that for a second. Just, I'm sorry. It's <laughs> that is so fucking Get the shot. Get it. Look at that light. Look at that light and do it. Yes. Drop the thumb hand a little bit. There you go. Bam. Wow. Eyes to me. Wow. Push it up yeah, a little bit. Nice. Look at that. It's great. It's great. It's good light. <clears throat> yeah. Good job. Yeah, I hope that's really good. Shallow depth of field, right? Where's your depth of field, dude? So you, well, oh, shut up! It's fucking not shallow at all. Yeah, they but mean, he has to. I to request him to. They not. want, they want, they need pussy and face and focus at the same time. This is a 2.8 lens. I'm shooting at f5 to give him a little bit because I don't want to fucking give him too much. Yeah, if, this if, if I was to really do it, this is a 1.2 lens, and I shoot ridiculous. it and I shoot it on 1.4 right now. Yeah. However, none of his are in focus, though. All of mine are. <laughs> <laughs> um, I have a lot of missed shots. That's why I just take more. Yes, <laughs> with that channel that you feel like the slightest movement, the yeah. slightest thing, and then the eyes are out of focus. So you just have to shoot more. I just want that body. I'm all ready. Oh, that was a good shot. Suck his own dick. That's yeah. what all he's trying to do. That's the goal. I wish I could. I wouldn't be here. <laughs> I wish I could. I, I wouldn't, wouldn't fucking. Be I wouldn't be in a relationship. I wouldn't have a job. I'd be fucking homeless, just sucking my own dick all the time. I feel you though. You know what I mean? Push it up a little bit. But it wouldn't be like a good suck, you know? What I mean? If so, I could eat my own cunt, I would never do anything else ever. Stay in your bed forever. Yes. Yes. What am I gonna put eat? Put it on the internet. But no, like, I've been eating in days. Yeah. I've been eating pussy. <laughs> so famished. Um, but yeah, same thing though. Do the lean forward, yeah. I'll do this. Well, that's just sounds ridiculous. I'll never be able to do that. I have to like, do some Look at that light. Too. <laughs> Hair patrol. <laughs> nice, baby. 
Look down at that booty. Eyes. your full name. My name is Samantha Hayes. Hey, Samantha Hayes. <laughs> you are a very, very pretty girl and I'm a very lucky guy today. <laughs> I'm a very, 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 very lucky slut today. <laughs> you like to call yourself a slut. How comes that? I, I am a slut. I, um, I, I get off on enjoying all of what life has to offer and a lot of that for me is sexuality. I'm uh, I feel very free by naming myself a slut, you know, because I am, you know, I take no offense to it. I I enjoy sex and I'm happy with it. <laughs> uh, when did you find out or when did you realize that uh, you're such a sexual person? I, I think that it was definitely before I got into porn. I um, I did my first nude photo shoot about a week and a half or two after I turned 18 just because I knew that I wanted to have nudes of myself at 18 for the rest of forever. And the more I, I got into that world, um, the more I became accepting of myself and my sexuality for the first time in you know, my whole life. And it just opened so many doors for me and really changed my perspective in a very positive way. Yeah. I have nudes of myself where mm -hmm. I was like 15, 14, uh, mm -hmm. but they were not sexual. They were just made on nude beaches with a family mm -hmm. vacation. Uh -huh. uh, so um, you always uh, combine the idea of nudity and sexuality? No, I, I started with artistic nude modeling and did um, did fetish and stuff. I actually was too scared to show my vagina in my first few nude photo shoots, so it would be these um, artsy poses with um, oil and water or um, grinding metal and very body skate style, but fully nude. And um, it definitely... Um, the, the photos themselves weren't sexual, but the experience for me was sexual. Um, and I guess what I mean by that is the, the photographer wasn't you know, standing there jerking it or anything. They didn't even say anything sexual. But for me, um, as an exhibitionist, exposing myself um, and knowing that other people are going to see it is genuinely arousing for me. Did you masturbate? before while thinking about being nude in front of other people? I definitely did. It was it was a, an ongoing fantasy. I, I've always had fantasies of being um, a little center of attention with multiple sexual eyes on me. And <laughs> now I get to live it. Now you definitely get to live it. And do you ever imagine while shooting a scene about the people who are gonna watch it and jerk off to it? Oh, often, often. There are, there are some days where, um, you know, if I'm talking with my fans, then 
you know, I might be telling my fans exactly how I'm getting fucked as it's going about and they, they tell me how cute I look and how excited I look and how they can't wait to see it. So it's definitely there while I'm getting fucked. Oh wow, I can't wait until they see this and it gets me off. <laughs> Uh, I talk to a lot of girls who see porn as a way to fulfill their uh, sexual fantasies because there are certain things they say they cannot get in or not easily get in regular life like mm -hmm. gangbangs, blowbangs, DP, mm -hmm. stuff like that. Is that also a reason for you? Uh, it definitely was initially. Um, I wanted to experience things that I had before but my, my concern was definitely with having tested partners and not everybody is, is willing to test outside of the industry. So, um, well, a lot of um, things I did experience on camera for the first time, like um, electric wands and stuff. I, I was fortunate enough to be able to have two cocks at once before I learned how much I love it and got to show it off to the world on camera. But blow bangs, oh, I, I'd fantasized about that for years, you know, even even before getting into porn. And unfortunately, <laughs> I, <laughs> I I definitely agree with you. I don't think I could have gotten a blow bang to happen without porn. <laughs> <laughs> a little hard to coordinate all that, but maybe maybe it's out there for some people, but. If I, as a porn performer, can't just go get blow banged any weekend I want, I think it'd be a little harder for people <laughs> outside, too. But if you got the tips, let me know so I can creep in the comments. And people who watch uh, my YouTube channel know that uh, on this set we are here mm -hmm. uh, for Paul Woodpress, director for New Sensations, mm -hmm. that we shoot the stills before the video. So we already had a little bit of sex. It's slow and staged. Mm -hmm. It's not like the action mm -hmm. we're going to have soon. Uh, but I could already... Um, a little experiment your body and I realized you're ex exceptionally, extremely uh, sensitive. I am. <laughs> uh, your vagina and your nipples are, you can barely touch them and you're almost coming. I, I am very multi-orgasmic. It's um, probably the greatest gift that I have ever been bestowed and it's part of why I wanted to get into porn because I, I know that statistically there are women that never experience an orgasm or rarely experience an orgasm and my sheer number of orgasms <laughs> in, in a short period of time just, it, it's insane, it's unrealistic, it needs to be videotaped and um, I found that working with professionals such as yourself who have spent years, even decades, training in the art of banging <laughs> <laughs> only further exacerbates that sensitivity so that I'm able to have even more orgasms, which, you know, I just love my job so much. <laughs> uh, you just called it an art, and I, I was talking in, my, in the introduction video for my YouTube channel uh, about the art of pornography, because mm -hmm. I truly believe pornography uh, in any form, if it's uh, paintings, writing, mm -hmm. uh, whatever is an art form, uh, even though a lot of people just call it smut. Right. Um, but I, I love pornographic art. I do too. I think that, you know, it, it's very easy to dismiss sex as a smut as opposed to art because we have such a nasty, unhealthy stigma associated with sex where, you know, it has to be the sturdy thing that we hide away. There's no way it can be beautiful or amazing or artsy. It has to be hidden. We can't, if it, if it was artsy, then everyone would be able to see it, but we have to keep it hidden. And I, I certainly don't agree with that. I think that a lot of people agree with us, and that's part of why um, porn has changed a little bit. There's more people looking to make art out of porn rather than just smut. <laughs> okay, my dear Samantha, then uh, let's make some art and afterwards we talk about it, okay? Yes, please. Can't wait. Mwah. Mwah. <laughs> Can we just have a hug first? Like, mm. Here oh. we are again. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs>
Oh. So you asked me to blow smoke in your face. Let me yeah. see if I don't cut off your hand. You're so tall. No, it's perfect. Um, but we have to do that outside. We're in uh -huh. California. Exactly. Exactly. Mm -hmm. The life. So you don't smoke, but you like smoke? I, it's, it's actually terrible. I have a very, very, very deep-seated smoking fetish, mm -hmm. but I can't personally smoke anymore. I'm, oh. I have too addictive of a personality. I'll, I'll go through like a pack or two in a day, but mm -hmm. when other people are smoking, the smell, the, the taste, everything about it is so sexy to me. So I was hoping you could blow some in my face since I just got fucked so much. <laughs> but I'm not allowed to say that on YouTube, screw Oh, yeah, 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 you can. We, we, we can talk actually about everything, we cannot just, just not show it. Just can't show it. And they probably age restricted or so. It's depending, mm -hmm. sometimes they do, sometimes they don't, I never know. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, my dear Samantha, it was a pleasure to oh. shoot with you the first time. Oh, you were an absolute honor. I really can't believe that I got to not only meet you, but fuck you. Knowing that you've been fucking professionally for longer than I've been around, it's like the, the decades of knowledge and wisdom in that penis. <laughs> I, got, I got to experience a legend today, you guys. It was, it was a life changer for sure, and I can't thank you enough. I we hope we have the chance to shoot again. And maybe one of your fantasies, uh, like blow bangs or whatever. Okay, and I thank you for watching. If you like it, please subscribe and see you at my next clip. Thank you. Thank you so much. Bye.